everybody. For me, this is like the third time, but for you, it's the first. <laughs> Hello. So, I'm going to be playing a game called Celeste today. And this was suggested to me by a friend of mine, Zal. And he's been playing it on his channel, so I'll put a link down below to his channel so you can watch his videos. He's recently gotten back into YouTube. And I tried getting back into it like you probably noticed like I had some blooms videos on there but the reason I stopped doing videos and I think I should really explain more I'm gonna explain like a little bit here let's get started uh you know what I'm actually going to use my name I'm going to use Maya but anyway so the reason main reason why I stopped doing recordings was because I got more into music and so I've been doing more music and stuff like that, as well as the fact that I've been getting my teeth removed. Uh, oh, hold on. Uh, this is it, Maya. Just breathe. Do. Why are you so nervous? Okay, but anyway, so um. Just gonna sit here for a sec. So, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> that's actually kind of funny. I don't know why, but anyway. So the reason why I haven't really been doing recordings very much is because it's been really difficult for me to talk for the past like four or five months, and also like with the whole music thing. You know, I was like focusing more on my music for a while, but yeah. So what ended up happening? My family has a history of teeth decay, so. It's not like anything that we do, you know, it's not that we don't take care of our teeth and stuff like that. It just runs in my family. And it usually starts when we get, like, to our mid-twenties, early thirties. And I'm twenty-seven. So, about a year or so ago, my teeth started breaking. And they started, like, decaying and stuff like that. And then, when I was, like, twenty-two, just after I got out of college, you know, for nursing college, I got into an accident that basically made it so that my I got hit in the face with a lift it's like one of those lifts where I mentioned it before on my channel it's like one of those lifts where um yeah I, I by the way I know exactly what I'm doing because this is like my third time recording this by the way <laughs> but anyway so I basically I um got hit in the face with a swing lift where it's like Oh, no, a, swing, a sling lift and basically it's like the person sits inside of a sling and it attaches to a motor and like you can lift them up and then you can swing them around you know from like their bed to their chair or something like that you know or into a bathtub or something and I got hit in the face with the motor when I was about 22 so that broke my teeth a little bit so then they started breaking more and back I think in 2000 18 I started getting them removed like I started getting them like fixed and then uh, last year I think it was last May we realized that there was no point in fixing them so then back in March of this year of 2020 just before the pandemic hit we started removing them and it was considered an emergency because it was surgery so that's why I haven't been recording I've taken a break from getting my teeth removed. I've gotten about 12 removed so far. And I've still got the front teeth, but all of my back teeth are gone. Completely gone. Like, I've maybe got like, uh, I think 12 on the top and 14 on the bottom left. So yeah, I've gotten most of my teeth removed. So that's why I haven't been recording because my jaw has just been so painful, you know? It's like been really difficult to talk. Like, it's hurt to talk, it's... I've had, like, major headaches and stuff like that, you know, over the past couple of months. I've been exhausted, you know, been really tired and stuff like that. So that's why I wasn't recording, because I wouldn't have been very energetic in my recordings. So I wanted to wait until more work had been done and my mouth was more... less painful. Because... might not realize it, but... Dying teeth? are really painful <laughs> like I have a high pain tolerance and sometimes I would cry 
you know, from the amount of pain. So, yeah. Because basically what a decaying tooth is, is your tooth is broken inside, and it's basically rotting from the inside out. So you can feel it against the nerve, and the nerve is exposed. So that's what makes it so painful. So all of the like really badly broken teeth, you know, the ones that have the, the exposed nerves are gone. So then I've just got like the ones that like aren't too badly damaged, but so I'm going to be taking a bit of a break. I'm going to start again. Like, we've decided that we're going to like, I'm going to get another tooth removed next month. And then I'm going to wait until the beginning of the year. So I want to try getting back into recording and stuff like that, you know, but like I said, I've mostly been focusing on my music, and I will link a. I, I will put a link to my SoundCloud in the description. So if you want to check it out, then I'd appreciate it. You know, like, check it out. Let me know what you think. I do more techno kind of stuff, but um, I've recently been trying to do more acoustic. So, yeah. Anyway, but let's get into this. So, with all that exposition aside let's do this and then I'll explain what this whole series is excuse me ma'am <laughs> uh, this is sign outside this bus it's just the mountain trail you're almost there just across the bridge uh, by the way you should call somebody about your driveway the ridge collapsed and I nearly died ha 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 if my driveway almost did you in, the mountain might be a bit much for you. Ha 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 ha. Well, if an old bat like you can survive out here, then I'm- I think I'll be fine. Ha ha ha. Suit yourself. But you should know, Celeste Mountain is a strange place. You might see things. Things you aren't ready to see. You should seek help, lady. Yeah. Ha ha ha. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> anyway. Oh yeah. I really don't like this part, because, like, it's... I don't like things that, like, fall behind you, you know? Like, this kind of thing. There's, like, the, these parts, you know, where, like, they fall behind you. And it's kind of, like... Yeah. Woo. But, yeah. Anyway, so it's kind of, like, they fall, but I don't like that kind of thing, you know? Or, like, it's, like, a long bridge, and you gotta, like, outrun it. I never liked those. You can do this. Yes, I can. <laughs> anyway, so... Okay, before I get into this, this game was suggested to me by Zol. Like I said, I'll put a link to his channel. He did this on his channel. And... I've been wanting to get this. Like, I've been thinking of getting this for a long time, you know? Like, I've seen other people play it, you know, other than Zol. And so, I wanted to get this game. I was like debating, I'm like, uh, maybe, I don't know. But then I started watching him play, and I'm like, oh, hey, you know, that seems like something I would enjoy. So I started humming and hawing about it more. And then, this is actually the day after you, like, this is all. This is the day after you suggested it to me on your live stream. And so he suggested to me, I literally, like, within, I don't know, 10 minutes, I'm like, yeah. Okay, that's it. I'm getting it. So I bought it because I had like $30 left on my Steam, you know, from some gift cards that my dad gave me. And so, yeah, I got the game and I've already played the first level because what I'm going to be doing is like each um, area, like each chapter is going to be one episode. So, yeah, I'm not excited about the later <laughs> the later levels because I know what they're gonna be and I am so not looking forward to the B side. I will try them. I will try every level. I promise. But yeah. <laughs> I'm not the type to rage. I more so start laughing at myself. But like I'm not the type to like start swearing and stuff like that, but I will get really I'm probably gonna get irritated with this. I keep wanting to grab my mouse, you know, because, like, I'm so used to needing my mouse, but no, I can't use it. Anyway, so, yeah. Let's just get straight into this. This is, like, my third time doing this level. 
But yeah, so basically, this is suggested by Zal, and I did want to do this, so yeah. And like I said, I do plan on getting back into recording. I don't know, like, I'm not gonna set myself on a schedule just because, like, I do other stuff, you know? Like, I play um, a lot of high pixel skyblock with my friend Frozen Void. So, yeah, I don't. Remember? How did I get there? But yeah, so I'm not going to, like, set myself on a set schedule, you know, but I might actually do some videos of that one, you know, of, like, me doing that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I remember this. I was just looking like, oh, I can just dash up and get that. No. <laughs> it will fly away if you dash. Yeah, so if you dash up, it'll fly away. And yeah, I dashed up to try and get it. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna do that. Didn't work. Oh, I remember this. But yeah, so I might do like other stuff, you know, like other videos of like different things. I do actually plan on um, starting up a Minecraft survival with like the new um, 1.16 that came out for Minecraft, so I might do more videos of that. Like, I might do some a series of that, you know? But, for now, I'm just gonna do Celeste. And I might actually... Like, I'm pretty sure I'll remember. And... I th yeah, I'm like 99% sure I'll remember, but um... Yeah, I, know, I remember how to get that. I don't know if I want to go get it, though. Because I'm already over here. <laughs> but anyway, so... Uh, I'm thinking... Like, I think if I remember to do it, I'm pretty sure the intro and the outro to this video are going to be... Some of my songs. So, yeah. You know, if you guys want to check that out, you know... Yeah, those are going to be, like, some of the quote-unquote songs that I made. Specifically for my intros and outros and stuff like that. So, yeah. Oh, there, Traveler. Uh, oh, hi. Well, uh, what a killer night for hiking. I guess so. This place is so crazy. <laughs> I was- I heard, like, a purring, okay. And I, I'm pretty sure I've mentioned that I forgot two new cats. Um, Jack, who's an Egyptian Mew, and he's my baby. Like, he is a total mama's boy. But, uh, <laughs> I heard Purry, and I turned my head, and there's Jack just completely passed out on the end of my bed, purring like a freaking motor. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear it, but he's fast asleep, purring and snoring. Like, he doesn't really snore too loud, he kind of does like that breathing snore, you know, like <sighs> kind of snore, but he's also purring, so it's like, <sighs> it's like <laughs> And funny thing is, this morning, he like, I've been up since 7 o'clock, and he woke me up at 5 o'clock this morning Well, hi baby, yeah, I'm talking about you, hi He just kind of like, <sighs> you know, up at me it's like, yeah, I'm talking about you. This morning, he decided that he wanted to cuddle, so he just like he came up to me. And the way that I sleep is, I have a pillow at my head, but then I've also got a pillow on my side. You know, because I tend to dislocate my shoulder when I sleep, just because of some past injuries that I got, you know, and stuff like that. So I keep a pillow on my arm so that I don't like dislocate my shoulder too often and he decided that he was gonna crawl in between my side and the pillow so he's like curled up beside my ribs like with his head just shoved into my ribcage and his butt was shoved into my armpit and he's laying there and he's just 
so loud, and he did it for about 45 to, an, like, 45 minutes, roughly, about, like, 45 to an hour. And then he just kind of gets up, licks my face, purrs at me, and bolts out of my room. And I'm like, huh, okay, that just happened. Wow. <laughs> but yeah, just licks my face a bunch of times. It's like, huh, bye, baby. <laughs> But yeah, and then we've got another little kitten. She's a ragdoll. She's only a couple months old. Like, she's only like a month old, I think. Pretty sure. I think she was like, yeah, she's only about two months old. Because she was like four weeks when we got her. So yeah, she's about two months old. And she's a f hyperactive little thing. She will climb everything. She steals our elastics. If you have cords out, she will steal her cords. So I've got to hide my chargers. Because she will steal my chargers. And I can't have, like, anything, you know, small out on my desk, because she'll steal it, too. So, yeah. It's fun having kittens. And then, of course, we still got the other two, Kirby and Ellie. You know, they're still going strong. You know, Ellie is still the cranky elder. <laughs> I guess you can call her. The cranky lady of house and then Kirby is just Kirby he's hyper but he's very easily pissed off so yeah by the way I'm not reading these because like I've read all this stuff like eight times <laughs> so yeah well I went to a talker mysterious wolf backstory okay hi sorry Maya got lost in uh, my mind well Place. So, the uh, what far off land? No, I mentioned like in one of my failed recordings that that like the second part. Well, my I'm not gonna attempt to say that because I have trouble saying words with Q U and R is in the middle like that. I know how to I know what the words are, but I can't pronounce them. So yeah. So, like, if there's any words like that that's like, oh, I'm not even gonna attempt that. It just means that, like, it's... My speech impediment won't allow me to pronounce those words. Because they're not words I say often. So, yeah. <laughs> just a little heads up. You know, if I say, oh, I'm not even gonna attempt that, that's just because it's a word that I can't say with my speech impediment. This place is wild. Abandoned. Uh, I make a corporation. Building. I wonder why. Uh, my mom's on government cover up. What a waste. So, at least get to enjoy leftovers. Yeah. Nah, I have things on. Talk for. Really cool. A blog or something? A blog? My. Uh, everyone uses Instapic. <laughs> I actually have my own Instagram. I post a lot of photos on there of like Jack and Star and various things that I get, you know? The summit. Did, uh, say so. Did make it the summit too. Maybe. I don't really care about reaching the top, to be honest. But hey, I know that shit older in this film. Like. Uh, I just thought I would see it for myself. Okay. Well. Yeah. Um. Dude. I'm. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna go. Bye. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. It's like one of those things, yeah. I don't know. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> but yeah, so I guess, like I said, I do have an Instagram too. No, I'm trying to dash up. Jump. Dash. There you go. Good girl. To Ugh. I kept running into that in like one of my other recordings. I think it was like the second recording I. Or first recording I did. No, second recording I attempted to do. I had, like, I hadn't come up here in the first recording, so the second recording, I kept running into the spikes, and I couldn't figure out why I kept dying, and I was basically running forward, and I'm like, why do I keep going into the, like, why do I keep jumping into the spikes? I didn't realize that there was a spring there, and then I'm standing there, like, oh, there's a spring there, oh, I, I accidentally let go, but I'm standing here, I'm like, oh, there. <laughs> 
I'm standing here and I'm like, oh, there's a spring there, guys. Look, I'm not going to walk into it again. I've walked right into it. I just did it again. Explaining that there's a spring there. And I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm not going to walk into that spring and I walk into the spring. Typical. Ugh. <laughs> Jeez, though. <laughs> like, oh yeah, I'm not gonna walk into the spring. I'm walking to the spring. <laughs> oh, that's typical me, though. I think, um... Also, in the recording, there's a part here where... I think, like, I'll let you guys know when it comes up, but there's a part that I was just so confused on, I couldn't figure out what to do. Right here. Okay, so I couldn't figure out what to do. I totally didn't click that that green orb gives me back my dashes. So I was hanging off the wall, like, how do I get back over there? Because I'm like here, you know, I'm like, okay, I gotta use a dash. And I'm sitting here, I'm like, how do I get back over? Because I need a dash. I'm like, huh. And then finally I'm like, oh yeah, that gives me back. I sat here. No joke, for 10 minutes, trying to figure out how to get past that part because I totally blinked and forgot that that thing gives you back a dash. And then this one, I was like, I kept walking into the spikes like that. Like, legit, kept walking into the spikes. And then I think a few times I actually crushed myself. But yeah, these were like, a lot of these, you know, the first time that I recorded, I was... Still trying to get used to the controls. Like, I've gotten better with the controls, you know? So. Because, like I said, I'm used. I don't know. Actually, no, I don't know if I said it in this recording. I've said this so often. Uh, my controller for my computer is broken. So I've got to get a new one. And I've got one on hold. Like, I've got one ordered. And it's supposed to be in next week at EB Games. Like, at the EB Games near where I live. So, I'm gonna go, like, they said that it should be in sometime next week. They're gonna let me know exactly when. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're gonna, they said that they're gonna let me know, like, when it is, you know, I'll get, like, a phone call, you know? So, I have to let me know when my controller's in. But, yeah, so. Oh. But, yeah. Anyway, so, I. And right now, I'm using my keyboard, which is kind of tricky. <sighs> but I've kind of gotten used to the controls, thankfully. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember this. Ah! <laughs> yeah, I, I, how on earth did I manage to jump underneath it like that? Come on. Oops. Come on. No! Come on. Ah, I gotta save my dash there. Come on. Eh. Oh. <laughs> you see, like I said, I don't really rage. I just gotta start laughing at myself. I did it again, oh my god. <laughs> okay, do this. Oh, I can't grab on. Go here. Okay, go like that. And then, there we go. See? Yeah. There, got it. <laughs> okay. But yeah, anyway, so... Oh. This is another thing that took me a while. I couldn't figure out how to get that strawberry. I don't know if I'm actually going to get it now, but... <laughs> yeah, it took me forever to get this strawberry. Ah! That's why. <laughs> Got it. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oops, I did not want to dash. There we go, go there, there. Ah! <laughs> oh. I want that strawberry, I, I want it! I need it, I need it! Oh, dang it. Oh wait, oh. 
I can't get it without a dash. Okay. Ah. Go. No. <laughs> I caught it before. Okay. Yeah. Ah. Okay, I didn't fall far enough. This is where most of my deaths were in the last couple of recordings, too. <laughs> actually, oh, wait, I can save a dash there, so I can actually go up. I, I, got, I got this, okay, I know what I can do. I know how to do this. Okay, so go here, do that, fall down, there we go. Wait. Ah, oh. Okay, wait, I gotta use that to jump with the momentum. Oh, wait, actually. If I go like that, ha! Huh. Yes. <laughs> okay, there we go. I think like uh, in one of the recordings, I managed to get here. We go like this. Yeah, I managed to do that, but I didn't use a dash there. I don't know how I got that one before, but... Yeah, I don't know. I managed to do it without using a dash. <laughs> yeah, I managed to do it without using dash here, so I got on the other side somehow. I'll figure out how to get that some other time. Eh. Oh. Dang it, I almost made it. I know there's a strawberry up here, and I know how to get it, so I'm gonna go get it. Oops. Aha! Yeah, I know how to get the strawberry up here, so I might as well go get it. Oops, I missed where I was supposed to grab. Heh. Let's go. No. Come on, Madeline. Or I guess your name Maya right now. <laughs> I guess that's what I named it. Boom. There we go. Hello. No! <laughs> Boom. Oh! I keep dashing the wrong way. See, I know how to get this. There we go. It. Yeah, that's right. Just walk off the edge onto the spike so I don't you. Come on, you can do this. Nope. <sighs> this is another issue I was having before. I keep dashing in the wrong direction. No, no. Nope! Dang it. <laughs> keep dashing wrong way. There we go. Haha. -ha. But I kept dashing in the wrong way, so it was like. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember this. Boom, boom. There we go. And then here, no, oh, here, here. Oh. Well, it would help if I actually stepped. Oh, come on. There we go. Good job. Good job. You got it. <laughs> I know how to get that. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna. <laughs> it's not out. <laughs> ah. See, I remember how to get this. 
I gotta get that one too. Oh, oops. Okay. I was close. But yeah, I know how to get this. It's just a matter of timing it correctly. You know? This is actually pretty, oh easy to get, but you it's going in the keep going in the wrong direction, no. Ugh, nope. There we go. Got it. Oh yeah. Okay, I remember this one. Actually, I'm gonna go down. And get this one, because I know... I remember how to get this. Oops! Remember. No dashing, Maya. <laughs> no dashing allowed. I gotta take my finger off the dash button, otherwise I'm gonna want to dash. Woo! Oh, that was close. Okay. I remember I was raging really- well, not raging at this part, but I was really annoyed because I kept dashing the wrong way at that first part. And I kept dying. <laughs> oh, right. Whew. Oh. <sighs> There's a way to get over there without a dash, but it's really difficult. Oops. <sighs> oh, I said uh, I'm starting to get a slightly annoyed just because this is like my third, <laughs> like. So I've done like four test recordings, and I did two re two full forty-five minute recordings, like full run-throughs of this level. So, this is like my third time doing this level, so it's kind of like one of those things, you know, and like you constantly repeating the same level over and over, and it just kind of gets really tedious. It's like, I've done this before, let me do something else, please. Oh! <laughs> Down, dash, yes! Okay. But yeah, so it's like one of those things you're like, oh, I've done this so much, just let me be over with it. Oops. <laughs> Didn't actually want to do that. There we go. But yeah, so it's like one of those things you're like, oh, just let me be over with this level. This is another area that I was like raging or getting really annoyed on because like Ah No, dang it. But yeah, cause I kept falling and I kept like missing my grips, you know, and all that and D doing that <laughs> basically. Oh hey little girl! The star is in here, she's playing in a box that I set up for her. She doesn't really- the weird thing is, is Jack is very, like, timid and skittish, but he meows so loudly and so often. And then Star is the exact opposite. She's extremely playful and hyperactive, but she is silent. Like, she makes little to no noise. Ooh, come here, you little girl. Hello! Hi! Hi, Star! <laughs> she just kinda like grunts, you know? Hi! Hmm. 
Okay, go. <laughs> but yeah, Star just kind of like makes grunts and stuff like that, and Jack meows all the time. So, yeah, it's really weird. They're like polar opposites, but in a weird way, you know? Because like I said, Jack is extremely skittish, and Star is extremely hyper. But Jack is... Oops. Oh, that was lucky. But yeah, Jack is really quiet, whereas... Or Jack is really loud, whereas Star is really quiet. So it's like, huh, you know? Okay, yeah. No, 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 no. Leave my cords alone. Seriously. She just tried to pull out my charger cord for my phone. <laughs> Jack's just chilling on my bed, like, oh, okay, yeah. That's something that's there, like, okay, whatever. You know, minding his own business. And then Star's trying to pull my charger out of the wall. <laughs> anyway. Uh, memorial for dedicated to those who perished. Interesting. I actually thought that this was like a grave stone or like a grave or something like that rather than a campfire when I first saw it. I'm like, oh, well, that's just morbid to have there. But there we go. Chapter one, done. Hi, come here. This might have been a mistake. Hi! Hi, handsome boy. Come to say hi. Jack came to say hi. Hi! <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you curious as to what I'm doing? Are you curious as to who I'm talking to? Hey? Yeah. Like, what are you doing, Mom? Oh. My vocal little boy. Oh. <laughs> are you saying hi to everybody, baby boy? Hey? You saying hi? Hi. Oh. Bye, baby. <laughs> he just like bolted off. He just leaped over my head. <gasps> anyway. Oh, wow. That was way better than my last run. Like, my last couple of runs. The first run, I only got like six strawberries, and I had like almost 150 deaths. <laughs> Second round, I had like 19, 119, 120 deaths, and I got like nine strawberries. This is actually- I, I'm happy with this. I am happy with this. Oh, okay, so it tells me- wow, I missed so many there. Okay, I might go back at some point and get those strawberries. I missed something there. I don't know what that is that I missed. But anyway, so yeah. I might go back and get that stuff later. But anyway, so, yeah, my plan is, like, each episode be a level, so I'm going to end this here, and the next episode will be the old site, or chapter two. I might actually do, like, a couple of recordings in a row of different levels. I don't know. I guarantee you they're not going to be as successful as the last level, because the first, like I said, the first one, I've done like four recordings of it already like this is my fourth recording of that level so be prepared to watch me die a lot <laughs> but anyway so yeah uh thank you all for suggesting this i'm actually really enjoying this i'm really looking forward to what's in store for me you know and i'm looking forward to the later levels and stuff like that you know and i'm looking forward to the b-side and I'm looking forward to wanting to rip my own hair out from frustration, but yeah, so thank you for suggesting this, you know, I'm, like I said, I'm looking forward to doing this, and yeah, I hope you enjoy, so, that said, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video, bye!